Welcome back, everybody. It is National Student Athlete Day, and we're excited to highlight great talent and efforts here locally to build up our youth. So Bridgman Perkins is here in the studio with Baker's Hoops and Harcum College this morning. Hey, Bridgman. Hey, good morning, Kelsey and Amanda. Yeah, we are celebrating National Student Athlete Day in a major way this morning. I was just chatting with Gabriel Baker with Baker Hoops about how all of this just kind of came together. I reached out to his wife. His wife then told me about their amazing daughter, Amaris Baker, and she plays at Harcum College. And then we got the coach, Coach Riley May, and they just all came in and blessed us with their presence this morning. I'm excited to honor you guys. Thank you for coming in. Thank you for having us. Okay, so I want to just get right into it. Baker Hoops, you are impacting so many lives through sacrifice and tenacity. And I think that's just a wonderful and beautiful thing. Obviously, your daughter is a reflection of that. But so many other children throughout the Philadelphia area have benefited as well. Yes. Um, with our program, we've been in operation for, this is our 11th year. So um, Amaris is actually, she was our first member. Oh, wow. So, um... We believe in uh, promoting mm -hmm. uh, children. So uh, we believe that an athlete's mind, body, and spirit all has to be in agreement to produce ultimate results. And we're character first. Uh, that's how we select our, our young people. Mm -hmm. And we just, we, we continue the journey alongside with them. Yeah. And we provide instructions, guidance, mm -hmm. prayer, um, which is a big factor in Absolutely. within our program. Okay, and coach, talk about just the about the impact that she's making on the team this year. You played somewhere else, but you came back to Philadelphia, and you've been doing the thing. I am so proud, <laughs> so very proud. Uh, Amaris has been great since day one. Um, she's been our hardest worker all year. Mm -hmm. um, all the athletes that she's you know, has come her way, like regional player player of the year. Mm -hmm. um, she was just Go ahead, first. tell us those stats. You can brag. <laughs> we, we are bragging this morning on all the yeah, I mean, she, she's, accolades. She's been, she's, one, she's been one of the best players in the yeah. country all year. 27 points a game. Mm -hmm. was, led the country in scoring. Led all levels of Juco in scoring. Um, was just named the first team All-American. Um, I think she has a chance to be named National Player of the Year. Wow. Um, so she's been special for us. But aside from the stats, like she just brings a great um, kind of mentality to our team. Um, she raised the level of our play for for everyone on our team. So yeah. to have her come in and come in, kind of come in with the work hard mentality. Um, obviously coming from a Division One school, mm -hmm. you know, helped her and kind of gave her some insight and stuff like that. But for her to kind of come in you know, ready to work from day one, um, being very coachable. Um, and that's important. Yes, 100%. Yeah. 100%. Amaris, how have you enjoyed playing in front of your friends and family right here at home? Um, I enjoyed it a lot. Um, I mean, I love it just being back in that, that family like atmosphere, being mm -hmm. close to home. Everyone's able to go to the game. So yeah. that definitely just raised the roof, the confidence, having all the support at each game. So that definitely took part in our season as well. And as a standout player, how do you uh, pour into your teammates? Because I'm sure they look to you for guidance and leadership. Um, just coming every day, like in practice mm -hmm. games, just giving my all, staying locked in. Um, I mean, all my teammates know I, I love basketball. Like it's like my job. I take it very serious. So it's like, mm -hmm. all right, this is business. We want to do what we have to do in order to win, and push everybody like every single day so that we can get to that next, the next step and that next level and make sure that we win or do whatever it takes. Right, whatever yeah. it takes. Yeah. Okay, any just short words of encouragement to any students who want to accomplish what you've accomplished who may see this segment? Um, definitely work hard, believe in yourself, and just, you know, just believe in your heart and your mind. So. You first. You first. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll send it back to the desk. Thank you guys for joining us. Thank you for having us.